Hi. Yeah, not much. I'm going pretty okay. Loving MSN's venue and you know just Cali in general. This is great. That's right. But of course, you know now we got your boy coming up. Oh yeah, we Con Con. <laughs> oh, oh, Wadi over there. Up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Wadi over there chilling. We got matching shirts on. No big deal. Yeah, we, of course we got Wadi and Con Con. Shout out to Spiff. Yeah. What is, wait, is he actually gonna? Was he preparing uh, his Wii Fit for this? Oh yeah, Wadi's been actually trying to pick up Wii Fit Trainer lately. After, you know, Wii Fit's been getting some bumps, and not to mention Wadi's been playing Wii Fit since Smash 4, so... Uh -huh. Not as seriously as I mean, Rob, Mewtwo, of course, but... I mean, I, I've been seeing your tweets, I've been seeing, like, how much like, he's been, like, practicing the character against you. Dude, he sucks the fun out of Smash, I'm telling <laughs> you. Wadi's not fun to play with, he reads you. Oh, you're gonna jump? Nope, I already read it. But right now, it looks like Con Con kind of trying to hang in here. Had a lot of damage going on at first, but Wadi coming in fast with that combo. Just a few up tilts, just you know, stretching a little bit and putting some damage on Kong at the same time. Really good combination. <laughs> Speaking of combinations, we got we got the plunger to dare. I love that. Now that he, he can utilize the fact that he has sort of you know that projectile that'll knock into somebody and then go into a down air spike, clean victory in quick 30 seconds. I mean, my eyes were on Wadi to see what he was going to be using to like to really box out Kong Kong, but all eyes should definitely be on Kong Kong. Yeah, man. And he's coming out there again. Wadi might want to pay a little attention. Yeah, you saw him uh, uh, recover really far away to make sure he didn't get spiked again. Oh, yeah. He all the way around, but that volleyball almost going to take it away from Kong Kong. Even dodging Ooh. around these fires. Kong yeah. Kong trying to live still. Man, that, that thing is huge. And you saw him uh, like working his way around and make sure he's not going to get hit off of those projectiles. Something Wadi's been throwing for a long time in Smash history. Oh, yeah. Okay, get, but he's got the deep breathing going, and Nair's going to kind of stuff out Wadi's approach in the air. Trying to get another plunger. Ooh, that sun salutation right onto the shield, but of course Kong Kong ready for it. Gonna block it, have no problems. Holding on to this lead here and ledge guard situation. You see him throwing the plungers once again. That plunger is actually a really good tool now that I think about Ooh. it because it's actually deflecting the volley or the soccer ball. Right, but right there. Yeah, he's gonna go for that uh, cyclone and unfortunately get up smash on the punish for it. Mm -hmm. Getting the tipper up air. Now, oh, there's this combo starter. We saw the nair into an up tilt, but using the tornado answering right back against Wadi. Right, you saw Wadi hit that short combo, but of course he's not as comfortable with this oh, this character yet, so he wasn't able to extend it by too much. But I mean, I swear Wadi was behind by so much as suddenly it's 69 to 114. That's the power of deep breathing. Oh yeah, man. Just some good air circulation, the power of the sun, that's all Wadi <laughs> needs. <laughs> yeah, I've heard people refer to that as limit, man. That thing just hits so hard. Oh, 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 oh. what was that up smash? <laughs> or rather that thing helps him hit so hard. <laughs> Yeah, look at him right now, trapped on the left side once again. But Wadi, when he's out there, he utilizes the deep breathing, uh, having no problems at all. Yeah, it's really smart because Kong Kong's not exactly playing a character where he's going to be able to go off that deep. Right. So Wadi can like just utilize the off stage and just take all the time he needs to recover. Oh, whoa, wait! What? Why what? did that win box? That Excuse me? The sun move has a win box? I guess so. And uh, okay, somehow, unfortunate, uh, not able to make it back right there. I guess he didn't have his jump or something. Yeah, it's probably help from the wind box that, that just, you know, magically appeared, but Kong Kong going to close out that stock, and now we have one stock apiece. Yeah, okay, so suddenly Wadi's in the lead here for the first time in the set, kind of working him on this ledge, but Kong Kong quickly going to turn it around and make a fast combo start up. Mm -hmm. Even re re getting the read that a directional air dodge was going to come out, but just guessing the wrong direction. Right. All right, Wadi coming in aggressive to get himself back onto the stage, baiting a little bit with that deep breathing, not going to fully go into it. Mm -hmm, but another Nair connects, and now, yep, Wadi looking for that up there. Going to get a jab, one, two, three, from Kong Kong. Oh, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm surprised Wadi opted to go for a soft punish instead of hitting a smash attack since he had him buried there. Yeah, but now we see deep breathing. Now that F tilt should kill. The soccer ball connects onto Kong Kong and just salute the sun. <laughs> I mean, that, that timing has, has been ingrained in Wadi. If people are trying to land towards the ledge, near the ledge, stand at the ledge, roll at the ledge, doesn't matter. If you're near that thing, he's going to have the timing to uh, cover it with a good punish. I mean, especially with a projectile, where he's yeah. been playing like, projectile-heavy characters for his entire Smash life? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> I mean, back in Brawl, we did see him play a lot of Wario, so that's like the only one that didn't have like a chargeable you know, projectile that he played. He even played a little Samus, of course. Mm -hmm. uh, and Rob does have a chargeable projectile, even though it's not quite like a, a charge blast. Okay, well, I mean, Kong Kong, you know, he's doing his own stretches, trying to get his, <laughs> himself ready for Game 2 here on Final Destination. Right, speaking of a person who's been playing a character for a long time, Kong Kong definitely has a mastery over Luigi. Oh, character specialist def defines Con Con. For sure. As I don't think he's ever played another character. Ooh, that great combo right there. Gonna bring it back to even, but suddenly Wadi turning it around with those jabs. Yeah, and we see the jab getting grounded that time. 
Following up with an up air. Oh, oh my goodness. And I like that he went for a down smash to make sure he'd be low enough to not take a punish and still get his. That's right. Now oh we no. see the lead traps coming out from Wadi. Getting the deep breathing in. Now the pressure is... Oh! <laughs> You're not going to do nothing like that right in Kong Kong's face. You think you can whiff in front of him? No. Well, you're definitely getting the breathing. Is he going to touch him again? Nope. Instead okay. of mashing out and punishing with an up air. All right, so quick fire back from Wadi to turn this back into an even game. And he has deep breathing on deck. You see that man glowing. Oh, I love the glowing effects when it comes to the deep breathing. Makes it so apparent, but it, you know, at the same time, it looks so nice. Yeah, very Look at true. that glistening skin. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this man kind of moving weirdly off the stage. You got to be careful. You remember game one. He got spiked for that boy. You better be careful out there. Mm -hmm, but another jab combo is going to connect onto Wadi. And oh, Whoa! another up B, but this time not going to take stock. Not going to take Yeah, it. he's lucky there. You got to be careful with these whiffs in front of Kong Kong. He is ready to make you pay for it heavily. Mm -hmm, okay, now we see Kong Kong fishing for his, these aerials. Okay, see the rising there connect. And not able to really convert. Both players just retreating back to neutral. Ooh. Yeah, and I did like the way that he was using those because he could definitely tell what Wadi was trying to uh, move or in which ways Wadi was trying to move forward. So he's just covering that with a nice nair. Mm -hmm. You see, getting back on stage with whiffing grab. Oh, directional air dodge past that sun. Yeah, working his way back on with these fire bursts. He gets the grab here. Oh, into a cyclone that will take the stock. Only at 75% here. I'm surprised every time that connects. Just because, like, oh, yeah, that's right. That's still in the game. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, he's going to stick onto the stage and just bide his time to make sure that Wadi doesn't have any uh, invincibility. Ah, oh, but unfortunate. Whiffing onto his shield is going to make him lose that stock. Yeah, no invincibility needed to, to punish that. Right. All right, that shield getting smaller and smaller. Both of them in each other's faces. But, okay, they're going to back off a little bit, start throwing projectiles at one another. Oh, Nair into F tilt com confirms. This confirms from Wally uh, on Wii Fair. Actually, very surprising. It right. He's so proficient. All right, these Nairs into up air, but the tornado going to uh, actually clank. Yeah, I do like that smart utilization of the cyclone. And is the soccer ball going to. It's oh, spa hiked. I was like, that thing doesn't have that much knockback. <laughs> He's fine. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and look at that godlike Joker cosplayer in the